Welcome to Hunting with Hex. Welcome to today's show and Happy New Year. I'm your host, Mike Slankard. This week, we're going to be doing something just a little bit different. You know, we have over a decade of exciting hex encounters in our video vault. And this week, we thought it'd be fun to revisit some of the best that the past decade has produced. You know, from the earliest days, we've documented one amazing close-up encounter after another, showing our patented technology at work. On today's show, we decided to pull footage not just from the adventures of me and the Hex crew, but also from regular, everyday guys just like you that have seen the Hex effect and shared their experiences. These are situations just like you would encounter on your own hunts. You'll see regular guys doing things that just a decade ago were considered totally impossible, but now are considered commonplace when using Hex technology. It's going to be a great show, so sit back, relax, and join us as we go hunting with hacks. Hunting is about getting close. Really close. Get closer than you ever thought was possible. When you have a cameraman and you sitting out in a dirt field like this, you can get away with so much with this hex on. I've got to give credit once again to Hex. We showcase the science of getting close right here on Hunting with Hex. Hunting with Hex is brought to you by PSE Archery. Tough country, American values forged in steel. Ozonics, undetectable, undeniable. Victory Archery, the carbon arrow experts. Luminoc, light them up. Rocky Mountain Hunting Calls, we call the game. Tacticam, share your hunt. Warren Winches. Trophy Properties in Auction. And Hex Stealth Screen, the evolution of concealment. We're gonna start with a viewer submitted clip from John Howard from Northern California. You know, this clip was submitted way back when we were just beginning to fully understand the massive effect that hex technology has on birds and how they perceive movement. Since then, we've watched these scenes play out over and over, but this was one of the earliest clips that really showed what hex technology can actually do in the turkey woods. John was hunting out of a ground blind and he had three young non-shooter birds come in. So he turned his video camera on record slipped out the back of the blind and decided to crawl out at these turkeys. As you can see, John's crawling out in plain view of these turkeys. You know, what's going on is the hex suit is blocking all the electrical energy that's coming out of his body through his muscle movement. By blocking these fields, which are seen visually by turkeys, you're going to look a lot more like an inanimate object and you can get away with a lot more than you ever thought possible. You know, back when John filmed this, this kind of thing was something that no one would have believed possible. But now, hex users see it all the time. This was early definitive proof that something was going on that allowed hunters to get away with a lot more movement than they ever thought possible previously. As we now know, it was hex technology that made all the difference. Hi, I'm John Howard, avid bow hunter for turkeys here in California spring season 2013. I'm going to let you guys on a little secret. My secret is the hex suit. As you can see on the video this morning, I have an hour and a half to sit here in the blind. I got a mere 10 feet to free range Rio Grande turkeys here that have been hunted now for going on a week and a half. I tell you guys, if you want the advantage and you're a bow hunter, rifle hunter, photographer, you want to get up and close to this game, buy a hex suit. You will not be disappointed. I'm a huge believer in hex, and the reason is simply my success in the field. Time and time again, I have things that I just can't explain, and no matter which hunting camp I'm in, I feel like I'm having more opportunities than the people around me that aren't utilizing hex. The reality is, some animals definitely can sense things that we just don't know about, and with the encounters that I've had, I can tell you that Hex has been my clear advantage. This past year, I got within top pin range on a giant open country bull and just sat there for longer than I was even comfortable for. 
And when he finally pulled away from that tree and started to come to where he had heard my call last, he literally almost walked right over me. Had no idea what I was, even when that arrow hit. And I'm giving that credit to Hex. During the late season here in Iowa, there's nothing worse than being covered up with whitetails in a ground blind and having them look right in at you. I don't experience that anymore. I'm telling you, the proof is in the pudding for me. If you're interested in getting the best deal possible, make sure you use the promo code at the bottom of the screen. Or if you want to find out more, go to hexllc.com or give us a call at 541 575 Hex. Don't you crawl away. Hunting with Hex will be back right after this. Welcome back to a very special episode of Hunting with Hex. Today's episode is dedicated to the skeptic who wonders if Hex suits are really effective. Before the break, we watched as John Howard did the impossible and crawled to within 10 feet of some wild turkeys in the wide open. If that wasn't enough to convince you, then let's get back to the hunt. Well, on this next hunt, you're going to tag along with me as I hunt wild turkeys in Oklahoma with my bow. You know, this was a great area, and even though we were there a bit early, it was loaded with turkeys, and I was pumped to be there. You know, a lot of you know that now, in recent years, it's become normal for me to sit out in the wide open and shoot turkeys with my bow. But back when this was filmed, we were really pushing the limits of known technique, and we were blown away time after time on just what we could get away with. We'd hunted hard all week, but we were fighting bad weather and high winds. On the last day, my patience finally paid off. These birds fed slowly towards me, and as you can see, I'm sitting in the wide open. You know, they had plenty of time to pick me out, but they never paid any attention. With my hunting time running out, I decided if I got a chance, I was going to take one of these birds. I was able to come to full draw on these birds in plain sight with no reaction whatsoever. But even more amazingly, I was able to reload my bow and draw on a second turkey. Almost got a third. I tell you what, that is cool stuff. As you saw, that's uh, eight yards. Full draw. <laughs> they didn't have a freaking clue. Oh, I can't believe it. That is awesome. At the time, sitting in the wide open with no cover of any kind was considered insane. However, as you saw, I was able to draw and shoot not once, but twice and take two toms with my bow. This piece of footage may well be the first time anything like this has ever been accomplished on video. And as we know now, it was 100% hex technology that made all that movement possible. Well, here we are with both birds. I'll tell you what, this is a cool way to end a hunt. Um, it's the last day here and we had those three birds come in, eight yards. Um, you know, that's what Hex is all about. It gave us that little edge and we're able to, to get away with movement that you normally can't get away with, and that's what it's all about. We've shown you how the guys were able to do unbelievable things while wearing their Hex suits. But don't take our word for it. We get testimonials almost every day from satisfied Hex customers. Anyone who hunts from the ground is missing opportunities at trophies if they are not wearing Hex. Brad Golke. I have hunted for over 40 years, and Hex allows me to get closer than I ever did before. I'm Rocky Jacobson. I just wanted to send you this picture and tell you that my Hex gear performed flawlessly once again. Jason Bowserman. This spring, I had some great close-up footage of turkeys, which I attribute to my Hex suit, Jim Brennan. This Jake came in to 20 yards and offered a shot after he was bumped, Forrest Carter. The original Hex suit is very lightweight, breathable, and versatile enough to be used in almost any hunting situation. The Hex systems consist of three pieces. These essential pieces include a Hex pant, Hex top, and Hex head cover. You may use any combination of appropriate Hex products to achieve the goal of covering as much of your body as possible with Hex technology. All Hex hunting products are now available in our new Hex Style Anywhere and Hex Style Green digital camo patterns to match any terrain. The material features a highly electrically conductive carbon grid woven into the polyester-based cloth. 
The grid blocks your body's electrical field. The suit is designed to be worn under your regular camo or over the top as an outer layer. The technology is effective either way. The original pants are cut similar to sweatpants with an elastic waistband, elastic cuffs on the bottom, side pockets, and a convenient fly. The pullover shirt features thumb holes, serge stitching, and an embroidered logo. The head cover has a hemmed eye hole, adjustable drawstring in the back, and is very easy to use. Additional accessories are sold separately and include the hex hat, our versatile multi-rag that can be worn in a variety of ways, camo gloves made of a lightweight, stretchy material in matching camo, and a heavyweight over-the-calf sock. And of course, all of the accessories have the hex grid woven right in. Order right now and use the promo code to save $30 on your order of a complete hex suit. Learn more about our full line of clothing and accessories as well as our fit guarantee for worry-free ordering at hexllc.com. Don't turn that channel. We have a lot more turkey action right after this. Welcome back to Hunting with Hex. This week we're focusing on the amazing experiences hunters have while turkey hunting with their hex suits. From crawling up on turkeys in the wide open to coming to full draw and shooting a double with a bow. Hunters who wear hex get away with much more than they ever thought possible. Still need more proof that hex allows hunters to do unbelievable things in the field? Then let's head to Nebraska and join up with Jason Cleveland as he hunts some call shy toms. Well, it's been a tough season. We're out in Nebraska now at the back end of the season and the birds are acting exactly the same. They'll gobble at everything we throw at them, but won't close the distance. We got a bird that's been sitting out there gobbling at us for a few minutes. He went up over the hill, so we took the game right to him. We ran up onto the next ridge and he was yet on the next ridge, but he was gobbling at everything we did. So after about five minutes of that, I'd had enough. I said, I'm gonna crawl straight at him. And Joe set the tripod up kind of high, could see everything going on. And he kept calling as I crawled down through and up on the next ridge. Jason decides if the turkeys aren't coming to him, then he will go to them. I got on the next playing field with him, and I just kept crawling and waiting for him to spook or do something, but he never did. He let me crawl right up on him, set up, and I was waiting for him to run, but he stayed at full strut even when I set up, beat it down on him, and shot him right there where he is gobbling at us. Well, birds won't finish, but when you got the hex suit on, you can take the game to them. I crawled right up on that bird, rolled up on set up. He didn't even move, he just sat there and looked at me. My shooting was off, but the hex was on. And this is the result right here. A Nebraska, I don't know if he's a Rio or a hybrid or what he is, but good bird, wouldn't finish. Crawl right to him and take care of business. Our most popular hex system is our base layer. The base layer is a lightweight, semi-thermal material designed to be worn under your regular hunting clothing or over the top. It features the patented hex technology woven right into the material and now comes in both hex style camo patterns as well as solid grain. All complete hex systems include three pieces, pant, shirt, and head cover. The shirt is a quarter zip Henley with rugged serge stitching, embroidered hex logo, and thumb holes. The form-fitting pants have rugged serge stitching throughout, and the heavy elastic waistband and cuff ensure they stay in place. They also feature a convenient fly. Additional accessories are sold separately and include the hex hat, camo gloves made of a lightweight stretchy material in matching camo, and a heavyweight over-the-calf sock. Our versatile multi-rag can be worn in a variety of ways. Of course, all accessories have the hex grid woven right in. 
Order now and use the promo code to save $30 on your order of a complete hack suit. Learn more about our full line of clothing and accessories, as well as our fit guarantee for worry-free ordering at HexLLC.com. Now we're headed south where my good friend Brad Golke and I are chasing after some Texas Longbeards. This morning we heard a bird gobbling from camp, so we hurriedly moved in close and got the decoy set up. It wasn't long before that bird was strutting right into the decoys. This was an old bird with a lot of experience, and I could see as he got closer to the decoys, he wasn't buying it anymore. But unlucky for him, he was only 18 yards away, well within range, so I came to full draw without hesitation. Wow. How awesome is that? Big long beard. About 18 yards. Looked like it went right up through him. I don't think he's gonna go anywhere. What a cool experience. Wow. Beautiful, beautiful bird. Look at that, nice. Real nice beard on him. I'll tell you what, going straight away, that Homer Edge broadhead really took him. I'll tell you what, it went right through and uh, buried all the way up. And he didn't go very far. He's about 30 yards out probably. But uh, gosh, I couldn't be happier. Uh, like I said, the uh, just a beautiful old mature Tom. Um, you know, and to get him with a bow and arrow in the wide open. You know, again, that's what Hex is all about being out, being able to get away with movement. Hi, I'm Bill Epperts, and I'm very fortunate to be in the hunting industry and, and hunt all over the world. And uh, one thing that's really made me successful over the years is the Hex technology. And it's allowed me to take 18 Grand Slams of turkeys, two World Slams, the Big Five uh, in Africa with a bow, uh, also all the animals in New Zealand. And, and, and one thing that I think that really helps me, uh, and I, I, I preach this in my seminars, is the heck technology really works. Uh, it allows me to get away with more movement, uh, and, and the animals do not seem to be detect me in, in any way. So the next time you go out in the field, make sure you check out Hex technology. Welcome back to Hunting with Hex. We've documented one amazing encounter after another using Hex suits in the field, and we still have plenty more where those came from. Now let's head to Pike County, Missouri to hunt with Joe Ogden, Brent Lovell, and Jason Cleveland. Brent pops down, and the minute he, I zoom in on him, it seems like it's no time. This turkey pops up right on the other side of his shoulder. And it looks like they're on top of each other. And I was kidding you not, in two seconds, Brent starts moving, trick moving, fancy stuff. I don't know what he's doing. This turkey pops out, you can tell that Brent and the turkey are eye to eye. And Brent is apparently afraid of turkeys. So once this turkey's committed, he's coming right down the log and right to Brent. We're not sure what's going to happen. This looks too good to be true, yet Hex users experience these things all the time. A 
couldn't believe Brent got away with all that movement. I was laughing like a little schoolgirl. He was flopping around up there. We had no idea what he's doing, but apparently it worked and he pulled it off. I wanted to catch him. I didn't want to kill him. It looked like he was going to come up and peck on you. I was just sitting down, just far enough down that uh, I couldn't see him, couldn't hear him, nothing. And next thing you know, I heard a boop. And I looked to my left, and here he was at 10 yards, 15 yards. He got within five yards of me. Oh, we We've shown you the amazing results all hunters all over the country are having using their hex suits. Maybe it's time for you to own one of your own. I just came back from my bear hunt in Saskatchewan and I punched the tag on my biggest bear ever. Whew, that's a big bear. Oh man. You can see in the video, the bear kind of knew something was up, but I was wearing my hex. And I firmly believe in the hex system. I've been wearing it for five or six years now and I've been able to punch a lot more tags. I guide full time for a living and I make sure I'm always wearing it and my hunters, if they have it, I make sure they wear it as well. If not, I tell them about it. And we've killed a lot more animals wearing the hex. You still have to hunt smart and use the wind, but when the animals are in close, they just don't perceive you as a threat. And I've had great results on turkeys, bears, elk, deer, everything I've chased. So give hex a try. It's an awesome bear. He's got great character with that face being rubbed like that. He'll probably be close to a seven foot bear. It's hard to say we're gonna take a look at it and maybe weigh it, but it's definitely my biggest bear by far. Well, I hope you've enjoyed taking a look back at some of the early footage featuring hex technology in the turkey woods from all around the country. You know, over for over a decade, hex has changed the game for tens of thousands of hunters all across the country and around the world. If you're not yet using hex patented technology, now's the perfect time to get your own hex system on the way. If you're already in the HEX camp, you really need to check out the new products that we have. You know, we've added a lot of new cool products and features that'll enhance the HEX experience, and there's a lot more to come. Just give us a call or go online right now and get your own HEX system on the way. As I always say, it's gonna change the way you hunt. In the meantime, we'll keep pushing the limits and bringing it to you each week, right here on Hunting with HEX. Hunting with Hacks is brought to you by PSE Archery. Tough Country, American values forged in steel. Ozonics, undetectable, undeniable. Victory Archery, the carbon arrow experts. Luminoc, light them up. Rocky Mountain Hunting Calls, we call the game. Tacticam, share your hunt. Warren Winches, Trophy Properties in Auction, and Hex Stealth Screen, the evolution of concealment. If you have an amazing Hex encounter you'd like to share, give us a call or go online. If we use it on the air, you'll be in the running to win an exciting hunting trip with a Hex crew. You can find out more on our website at hexllc.com. While you're online, make sure to take a minute and check us out on our social media sites as well.